Hey there, I'm Dave Coach. Welcome back to my channel. As this video releases, I am actually on a plane on my way to Las Vegas. I'm heading off to, I think this is the sixth PMRE conference. This is the first year it'll be at the Palms. Very, very excited about that. They're also adding a new day that's all about commercial photography. I'm looking very much forward to that. But I wanted to let you know why I was going and what I think is important about it. First off, it is just, you know, it's something to look forward to in the beginning of the dead season for what we do. November, December, January, February is, is really pretty dead. So it's kind of nice to have something to look forward to as you're going into that season. But more importantly, and this is what I found true every single year that I have gone, is I get inspired by something somebody says. You never quite know who it's going to be. You never know what talk it's going to be, but something will click with you and you go, that's a change I wanna make in my business. This is gonna make my business better. And every year I've come back and I've taken those other couple of down months, the January, the February, and I've instituted those changes and I've seen my business grow and prosper because of that. You know, it's been some things like Kelsey's talk last year on, on the five important keywords that define your business. That's really helped me focus what my business is about. It's also given me the personal freedom to be able to take on jobs that maybe I wouldn't have, but also to turn down jobs that weren't necessarily in my area of focus. And that's given me a tremendous amount of freedom. Depending on where you are in the photography world, different talks are gonna hit you differently. I've seen talks about, you know, how to run photography businesses with multiple photographers. That has no application to me. But there are other ones that, like I said, strike home and make me change the way I do business. So all in all, I think it's a great learning experience. If you're someone who's watching my channel, you're here because you want to make your photography business better too. And I think this is one of the better ways to do that. Not only do you, you know, learn a lot about building your business, but, and don't discount this, you get to rub shoulders with other people in the industry. And that's so, so, so important. I think we are kind of at a disadvantage in that we're generally one man bands out there. We don't have anybody to bounce ideas off of or to learn from or to role model from. That's one of the reasons I started this channel was I was hoping that I could at least show people who didn't have somebody that they could sit there and watch so that they could learn how to do it, hopefully in a better way. That's really what my purpose is. And when you go to the conference, you meet a lot of other people that are in the same boat as you. And it's so important to share those experiences and to make those friendships and, and to add these people to your text list. Herb from HD Photo Hub gave a talk on mastermind groups. And um, that was another thing that changed me. I really, I, I have since then, I've been in a few mastermind groups. One is a group of photographers mainly in the Pacific Northwest. Another is a group in kind of the Midwest, Denver, Jackson Hole, me, you know, and one of the great things about this is, is we're, none of us are in direct competition. So we can text each other and say, how would you handle this situation? Whether it be a business question, like how do you bill someone? Or I've got extreme backlight, how would you handle this? But everybody is on there to help you. And I think that's really important because if you don't have somebody that, that is mentoring you directly, it's great to have a resource like that. And I've developed all those resources by going to PMRE. So anyway, I don't want this to sound like an advertisement for PMRE, but I really do stand behind it. I think Brandon Cooper has just done a tremendous job in developing this and building this and creating something that's now very important for real estate photographers across the US and into Canada. So I suggest that if you're not going this year, that you make plans to go next year and to work November into your schedule so that you can go to PMRE. 
I have a really good friend, a guy I've known almost 20 years. We worked together uh, for Fox News. We were both photographers in TV. And he's coming to this conference this weekend and he wants to jump into real estate photography. He's been shooting for a long time. He knows a lot about photography, but he's smart enough to know too that you need to get on the ground and meet with people like this. So again, I cannot stress enough how important I think it is to meet and network with people that think the same as you. The third reason I give you for going is, well, it's Las Vegas. Enough said. I mean, come on. We have such a good time after hours. I mean, we've gone to, what is it, Hell's Kitchen? And oh, what was that one two years ago? There was one where we had an $8,000 uh, food tab. Um, that one was just incredible. And that was only 12 of us. So there's a lot of fun to be had there this year. As last year, Dan, Tara, and I are all going to the Sphere this year. We're going to see the U2 thing. So, you know, there's a lot of other things to do. And I think just, you know, at the end of the year, you need to cut loose a little bit, have a little bit of fun. It's always good fun to just go to Las Vegas. So, Lastly, and maybe most importantly, are the workshops that are offered there. Some are before PMRE, some are after, maybe not, maybe not after, I don't know. I just know that some of the best in the business are the people running these workshops. Brian Berkowitz did one, for instance. I've been through two of the Wayne Capelli, Tony Colangelo, and Fraser Almeida workshops on luxury photography. And, you know, I go back six months, a year later, and I'm looking through my notes and I'm still learning things from them. They were fantastic. And they will really give you a leg up on your competition. But probably most importantly is the bonding in those groups where you meet people from all over the country. I cannot stress enough how important networking is, whether it's people you meet in workshops you're taking or whether it's, you know, just people that you meet at the conference. Networking is really going to help you as much as you may say, no, I don't think so. Well, yeah, it will. To give you a flavor of what the workshops are like, we did a workshop in Carmel in April, I think this year. And it was for people who had already done the basic workshop with Wayne, Tony and Frazier. And we got to go out and actually go into the field in Carmel, which is just one of the most beautiful places in California, if not the world and shoot houses that you know are multi-million dollar homes. It was an incredible experience and you know we were doing that with 12 of the best photographers in the world. So we were pushing each other. It wasn't just Wayne, Tony and Frazier that were helping. Everybody was helping everybody else. Everybody gave and made that experience just wonderful for everyone participating. We all had just such a great time and became really, really good friends. Believe it or not, everyone is still on the WhatsApp app and we're still texting and communicating on that. But during the process of it, one of the guys, Eric, happened to rent a car that turned out to be a Maserati. And the way my brain works, if it works at all, Maserati, the first thing I think of is Joe Walsh. If you don't know what that reference is, you will. In any case, you know, my brain's working. I'm thinking Joe Walsh. We're goofing around in the car. I start shooting some video and the next thing I know, I've got this whole video planned out in my head. Video didn't turn out quite like I thought, but it turned out, I think, pretty good. It's gonna premiere this week at PMRE at the QB Casa Suite on, I think, Thursday. If you want a sneak peek at it, There'll be a link in the, uh, in the notes below. So go ahead, take a look at it, see what you think. And like I said, that'll give you a real flavor for what these workshops are like. They're tough, they're hard, they're grueling, but they are fun and the people just make it fantastic. Anyway, I think that's enough. I think you get the idea. I'm fully behind PMRE and I just think, again, Brandon Cooper deserves our thanks for just sticking with it and making the conference as a whole a giant success 
and just making it all work. So again, thank you, Brandon. Just to conclude, I'd say go to PMRE. If you're on the fence about it, go next year, do whatever you have to do to go. I think it's very important to growing as a real estate photographer. And if you're going this year, and if any of my videos have been helpful, come up and say hi. Thank you very much. I really wanna hear from you and let me know things that I should touch on next year. I've already got next year planned through, I, I've actually got the, the videos uploaded through next uh, April. So I've got a roadmap, things are happening. I've got videos planned for every week, so there won't be any weeks without anything, except a little bit around Christmas this year. I wanted to, you know, just leave that time off, but let me know what you wanna hear about. Let me know where I should go. Let me know what I'm doing wrong. I'm happy to listen to that too. But definitely come up, say hi if you're at PMRE. Let's have a drink, let's have some fun. And may your next image be your best image.